Hello and welcome back to Dial H for Hero Clicks. We've been having an amazing Gen Con weekend and special thanks to WizKids for giving this opportunity to us to show off the first appearance of the Avengers Iconics box. Beautiful figures laid out in front of us, but first I want to talk about the box. We've seen this with the Wolverine first appearance Iconics. It mimics the comic cover using the actual Hero Clicks figures in place of all of the art. I love it, and all the cards do the same thing. You pop the box open, you get to see the real comic art not using fi the figures inside the box, and it's just absolutely stunning on a day like any other. Ooh, yeah. What I really Avengers love about assembled. this, oh man, growing up, in my local game store that I started playing Heroclix at, this comic was available in about a four condition for $1,100. And I remember thinking as a child, one day I'll own that. And that'll be the symbol that I made it. I loved the Iron Man armor growing up. This was something that I saw every Friday and just thought, yeah. man, this would be super cool. But let's talk about the Absolutely. man himself, the man of gold, called to kick the us off. comic accurate. Sculpt Iron Man. I absolutely love this big golden armor that he has here. So Avengers Stark Industries Armor Past and Scientist, which is really cool. He has a trait, Solar Powered Flight. When Iron Man is given a move action, after resolutions, remove an action token from him. For those that have been playing Hero Clicks for a long time, you know this is how the old Avengers team ability used to work. So I love this throwback. It's really cool. Very he has a special defense power, his first four clicks of life. It's invincible. Once per turn, when another friendly character with Avengers is hit, that character may use Invincible for that attack. Super cool. Love handing out the defense power. He's going to get that on his 50-point line. Super fun. On his last three clicks, four clicks, he has a damage power. We are the Avengers. Modify Iron Man's combat values plus one for each other friendly character that can use this power. That rocks. So if they're all That's low crazy. dial, they're all next to each other, they can be plus three combat values. It's so fun. The entire card, all of the text is in the same kind of font as the Avengers box, even the Avengers like team ability. The color is it's so, so good fun. too. Oh, the reds and the blues, they just pop so much. Even where the points are at, it. there's that little burst with uh, like 75 yeah, little, and 50. Whoa. And that's also very nice is that they're all going to be the same points. Right. So Thor, who is an Asgardian Avengers deity, scientist, and warrior, is coming in at 75 or 50. He also has Mjolnir's Magnetic Pull, Traded Plasticity. When Thor attacks, before rolling, he may place an adjacent opposing character into any other square adjacent to himself. Mm. He also has an attack ability, the Mighty Thor, Knockback. Once per turn, when another friendly character with Avengers team ability hits, they may knock back all hit characters. That's pretty fun. He also has the We Are the Avengers trait on his last four clicks as well. So when the team is down and out, that's when they shine the most. I love it, dude. They come together and it rocks. The Hulk, of course, from the most iconic mm. Avengers, Avengers brute, monster, and scientist. He has a trait. Nothing can, can hold the Hulk. Free, once per game, remove all action tokens from the Hulk man. and destroy <laughs> all terrain markers adjacent to him. This rules, man. Hulk is like, oh, he's double tokened. No, 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 no. Boom, totally freed up. You thought your opponent, you know, thought he was safe. He's not, not even close. Special speed power, first four clicks of life. Charge, once per turn, another friendly character with Avengers can use charge. Automatically, just handing out move and attack to any friendly Avengers character. That rocks. I love it. He's got big, beefy combat values. That's what we expect from the Hulk. And, of course, his last four clicks, he's got that We Are the Avengers special damage power. With some nasty powers, too. Flurry oh, I love the, the flurry, end, dude. He can be a 13 for 6 on his last <laughs> click. That like rules. The most optimal situation. Yeah, exactly. When dude. your opponent is just like, hitting you down to your last clicks. You know? <laughs> That's very fun. <laughs> I want to see Hulk be Hulk, you know? Exactly, man. He's got to be the big, yeah. beefy Avenger. Just <laughs> Hulk smash. Hulk smash, right? That he does. Closing out the hero side of things is the Wasp and Ant-Man, which they have Avengers Scientist, and then a very fun trait of Ant Tunnel Cave-In. Mm. When Wasp and Ant-Man hits, after resolutions, you may give each hit character an action token and remove any non-debris terrain marker in those character squares from the game. So holding like, or like an, if they're on an object, right. or elevated, you know, anything like that, tunneling from down under, getting you, pulling you down. They also have the Astonishing Ant-Man and Wonderful Wasp, free. Choose one. Move Wasp and Ant-Man up to three squares or make an attack. That is really Ooh. solid. I mean, you could carry these people, get a free attack. Yeah, I love That's that. always nice. They also have, at the back end of that, once per turn when another friendly character with Avengers team ability hits, after resolutions, you may give mm. a hit character an action token. And to no surprise, we see the exact same trait. Looks exact same, plays the exact same. But you know, sometimes looks can be very deceiving. 
very deceiving. And what is an Avenger set without their villain? I feel like it just got Alpha Strike. Loki comes in at 350 points. Asgardian Deity and Mystical are his keywords. He has a special trait, Mental Projections. Mind Control. Mind Control is free, but only if an opponent's force has two or more characters than your force. When Loki uses Mind Control, if he's 300 points, instead of rolling to hit, targeted characters become hit. I like that a lot. It gives him a good edge when he's like that 300 point, just one man army. I Insane. Like that. No senses, no rollouts. You're just hit. He has another special trait. Schemes and tricks. Probability control. When Loki uses it to reroll an attack, and the attack misses, after resolutions he may deal one unavoidable damage to the attacker. Okay, I like that. Some free damage, kind of getting off again. Why the whole one-man army thing, it Why helps not? out. He has a special attack power, Isle of Silence. Other characters within range can't be given free actions. Jeez. I love that. No perplex, no outwit, none of that. Map wide. He Ugh. has a special damage power, meddling from afar, shape change, and improved targeting through characters, blocking, elevated, and hindering. Yeah, honestly, this Loki really makes me want to play a thematic um, kind of game versus yeah. the four Avengers and Loki. Yeah, I think he rocks. I think he's in just an insane one-man army. He gives himself a lot of different uh, edges in certain matchups, especially against the Avengers here. And that's fun. That's thematic. It's Loki. He's a, he's a trickster, yes, you know? Man. So I think WizKids, you guys knocked out of the park with this Iconics. The Avengers, I mean, they're my favorite Marvel team. The first appearance set. It totally rocks. Thank you guys so much, WizKids, for giving us the opportunity to share this. I say y'all from the Alpha Strike, thank you for coming on. Thank you for, uh, I don't know where Ian went exactly, but uh, thank you for taking his place. And thanks for helping reveal Loki Anytime. to the world. So if you guys want to see more Alpha Strike stuff, check the link in the description below. This has been Dial H for Hero Clicks. I'm Calder Ness, and like always, happy trails.